Hello friends and welcome to Frightened Files. Tonight we are playing a horror simulation game called Zoo Kosis. Rescue the animals. So a little bit about the game. Zoocosis is a body cam horror simulation game. You are a zookeeper, identify infected mutant animals, make a vaccine and cure them. Will you save all of them and survive? So I suppose we can die in this game. I could also see there is nudity in the game. I have put it to off because I don't think YouTube appreciates nudity. <laughs> so without much further ado, let's check out Sukosis. Hopefully it's an epic horror simulation game we'll find out today so if you're a fan of horror games you know why not like and subscribe to the channel because we, we, begin, we only play put down your horror script. games here what definition of confidential information any information obtained by the night zookeeper during his employment is considered confidential Okay, do we need to read all this? I don't think so. Click here to sign. Let's just sign it. Put our John Hancock Excellent. or Paul you Connolly. Made the right move. Just a couple more things and you'll pull your family out of poverty. I really hope so. That's good. Attach this to your chest. Our scientists require us to do this to see everything that happens in the enclosures. Scientists. Awesome graphics, yeah? A zoo. True. Never thought that the smart Alex belong right in the zoo. <laughs> Hope you got the joke. Excellent. Mm -hmm. Now let's get started. First, grab your personal PDA. It's necessary for interacting with all the work objects. Congratulations. You've taken the first step to becoming a part of our Yay. close knit zoo family. Wait, what's this for? The hell? You'll find out later. Is that uh, like an antidote for the animal virus? What the hell is going on here? I didn't sign up for this. Oh, are you finally or awake? I actually Good. did. <laughs> get up. It's time to get to work. What the hell? What did you do to me? I took care of your health. Working with animals requires prevention. You wouldn't want to bring some kind of infection home, would you? By the I don't. way, I took your phone as well. I'll return it in the morning after the shift. So I got the job? I thought we had an interview. My wife is waiting for me outside. The job will be yours if you make it through the night. Let's go. I still have a lot to show you. That doesn't sound very promising. If it gets through the night. So awesome graphics, right? It's quite spacious here. Yep. This is our hub. You'll have plenty of everything here, except time. Now we're in the cold room. Here we store herbs, vegetables, and fish while the meat gets ground into portions for the animal rations. And right now we're running low on herbs and vegetables. Got the hint? Get to it. You can find the instructions in your PDA. All right, then. Load two herbal and one vegetable bricks into the brick trolley. So this is things. <laughs> okay, let's go press on things, I suppose. No? A bit more and you'll be left without explanations. Where are the things? Do I just press here or? Uh, vegetables, here we go. Pick up. Food. Am I supposed to wait for you forever? No. What were we supposed to get? Two herbal and one vegetable. Okay. Let's get some herbs. And there we go. Most of the bricks will be left as a reserve. And take these ones with you. It's time to show you our workhorse. Right at that. Are you grab this thingy. What was that? 
There's something in the works that you're not ready to know about yet. Let's start with the basics. Okay. And here is our K-A-T-I-E, Kinetic Automated Transport with Innovative Engineering. Katie will take you around the zoo. Alrighty then. It's awesome, we get a vehicle. This is the refrigeration compartment. You need to load the brick trolley here. Until you load it here, Katie won't budge. To load the brick trolley, you need to activate the lever. Lever. I always... I'm thinking it's a lever, it's a lever, lever, lever. So he says lever, okay. Is that the correct Aboard. pronunciation? Now select the giraffe enclosure and start the train. Do we do that from in here? Giraffe station. How do we choose the giraffe station? A bit more and you'll be left without explanation. Shut the f up, man. Direct. Here we go. Giraffe station. Start. Fasten your seat belts and sit up straight. Let's go. Sit down where? <laughs> Which seat belts? the giraffe station Yay. now listen carefully i won't repeat it twice this is our mobile veterinary station here you'll be mixing medications for our animals uh, are they okay. sick well they can be we need to closely monitor the health of the animals we have some quite rare specimens so the thought of anything happening to them is out of the question take this seriously and we should all be safe for another day all right then follow me this is our kitchen factory to collect feces for tests, you have to feed the animal its favorite food. Here's where you'll prepare it. Choose the recipe from the list. Cut, mix, and you're done. Any questions? Yes. Excellent. <laughs> A lot of the questions. It needs those who aren't afraid to ask. But even more so, it needs those who find answers themselves. All right, enough chit chat. Go to the cutting table. It must be here, right? Kitchen factory. You need to select the giraffe from the list. Giraffe and cook. Let's cook it up. Don't make a mistake with the weight. The exact measurement is displayed on the weight indicator. Measure carefully. 3.5 kilos. Uh, ah, here we go. Okay. It's not enough, Paul. Add more. How do I know when it's enough? Ball. Cut. Now do the same with the herbal brick from the recipe. Was that Go enough? Ahead. I have no clue. Click on the cut button to slice vegetables. 1.5 kilos. Total weight is 3 kilos. So half of it. Here we go. Is this good enough? Food is ready. Now activate the lever to lower the gadget trolley. Uh, where's the lever? I see no lever. I hear this. Here we go. Let's find those giraffes. Can we grab it? No. From the other side. I can't see where I'm going. Those damn rats. I never thought a zoo could be organized like this. A train? Trolleys? Yes, Paul, our zoo is quite unique. It's our pride. You won't see anything like it in others. Pride? But then why has the zoo been closed for the second year? People say the zoo is going through tough times. How would I know? I'm just a simple man. Clock in and clock out. 
How long have you been working here? Long enough to teach you everything. Come on, move the trolley. I am moving the trolley. This is the entrance to the enclosure. To open the door, you need to insert your PDA into the enclosure terminal and select Open Enclosure. Is that this thing here? Finally, we get to see some animals, right? Welcome to the draft. Before leaving, make sure that all the symptoms are detected. Okay, we have Bo, Poe, and Cleo. What do you mean? All symptoms are detected. Are they all detected? I don't know. We are in the enclosure. Now we need to feed our little creatures. Take the bucket and dump the food in the feeding area. Take the bucket. What bucket? This bucket, okay. Pour the food into the feeding area. Oh shit. Are you guys friendly? Please don't stomp on me. Yeah, I got food. Come on guys, follow me. Where is the food thingy thingy? Where I have to put the food? Oh, this is where they sleep, right? Hey Bo and Cleo. You guys alright? This must be Poe. Oh, here it is. Feeding area. Left mouse button to dump the food. Eat, guys. How awesome is this, man? The animals looks awesome. Aren't you going to eat, Poe? He's got a not happy face. Got a sad face. Hmm? Why are you sad? Are you sick? Go have some food. Maybe that'll make you happy. Are these guys happy now? Well, they have no... F no face icon. Hopefully that means they are happy. Giraffes are good, I think. Great. Now put on the MFE. What's that? Mobile fecal extractor. In simpler terms, a shit sucker. You've eaten shit before. <laughs> now Have I? you're going to suck it. I don't know. <laughs> Why do we need all this? We need to suck the shit. They monitor the health of the animals, and taking excrement for tests is one of your key tasks. A hundred thousand a year, Paul. A hundred thousand fucking American dollars. You just have to collect the shit. That ain't bad, Come is it? Come on, Paul. Don't chicken out. Where's the MFE then? Where's the shit sucker? Is it here? Ah, oh, here it is. Vacuum up the feces. Let's find some shit. Do you shit where you eat? Is this shit? No. Here's some shit. We're a shit sucker. Here we go. I have more shit lying around. You haven't... Please don't shit where you eat, okay? No. Where you sleep. Can I suck up the giraffe? No. If you can pet them. How awesome is that, man? Hey, boy. You alright? Oh. So, did we get all the shit? Or is there more shit lying around that I didn't see? Are we good? No, we're not good. Okay. Oh, we have some shit here. Great. Now put the shit sucker back in its place. We need to 
check something else. Let's bring it back to shit soccer. Now, take the TIS. To avoid unnecessary questions, it's a thermal imaging system. You can just call it a thermal imager. It's needed to determine the body temperature of our animals. Okay. Take the TIS. This actually means shit. No. It means piss in Danish. Good. Now <laughs> install it and measure the temperature of the giraffes. Enable with left mouse button. For the 1.1. Is it degrees or Fahrenheit? Or Celsius or Fahrenheit? I don't know. You guys are right? Bo? 39.7 And how about you? Cleo? 39.1 Okay, they're all stable at somewhat the same degrees That must be Celsius, right? When you're there, grab those two. What did you say? Turn the tis to the gadget trolley. Will do. Oh. God damn it. Uh put. As you can see, one of the giraffes isn't doing well. We need to make a dark. Oh yeah, to one was forty one. It's a medication right? for normalizing the temperature of animals. By the way, it was developed by one of the local eggheads. Interact with the terminal and press the exit and closure button. This one? In the terminal, you can check all the analyses you've collected. Oh, was not good, closure. I suppose. Right? Click on the button to exit enclosure. Alright, take the trolley back to the train. Do I have to make some medications too? Well, you studied chemical technology in Indiana. You'll manage. Damn. How do you know Damn. all this? <laughs> Trust me, it's not something worth being surprised about here. But I barely lasted six months there. Got kicked out in the first year. No, no duck. worries, that should be enough to mix a couple of ingredients following a ready-made formula. <laughs> Hopefully. Don't do. Mismed... Mismedicate the animals. Come on, move, duck. Ain't got time for this. You need to get to all the animals. I don't remember how many there were. I saw giraffes and gorillas. At least. Congratulations, Paul. You've just come closer to success and the well-being of your family. Now, go and load the collected fecal matter into the biomaterial receiver. Don't carry anything into the car. Everything must be sterile. And don't forget to put the shit sucker back in its place. Let's grab the shit sucker. Here we are. I put it in here. Biomaterial receiver. Yep. Feces. We have worms. Yep. And put this back. This game is awesome, you know? I love this kind of simulation games. Especially when it's horror as well. Are we done here? Where did you go? Oh Why shit! Are you so jumpy. Now you need to load the trolley into the train. To do this, press the okay. lever inside the car. You sneaky bastard! He kind of creeps me out, the dog. Excellent. Now this is our mobile vet station. To make Temporalax, you need to load the station with enough vials. I okay. did it this time, but in the future you'll have to gather the vials yourself to cook it up. But keep in mind, chum, there are not so many vials. Think twice before using them. Okay. Let's make some medicine. We need Temporella. Temper... Temporalax. <laughs> Click on a button to create Temporalax. Now go shoot the giraffe. Now take the dart from the dart dispenser. Is it this one? Cool, you've got temporalax. 
Now loaded into the veterinary gun. It's in the gadget trolley. Yeah. Dark gun. Here we go. Do you guys remember which giraffe it was? Aren't you coming with? Okay, gone in alone. How did we open this again? You're coming? I can't open this. Hmm? Do you shoot them from another vantage point or something? Where do you want me to go, Doc? Take the wet gun and load it with temporal legs using the PDA. Ah. Is this it? Use. Good. Now there we the go. only thing left is to dart the sick giraffe. Let's do it. Shoot the giraffe with a high temperature. And now we can go this way, maybe. The sick giraffe, Paul. Be careful. Don't confuse Bo with Bo. Which one of them was sick? I don't remember. <laughs> but I think we can see it, yeah? It's Poe. Okay. So let's make sure that we hit Poe. Shoot him in the ass. Right? You ain't Poe. Are you Poe? Here's Poe. Shoot him right in the ass. You cured all the animals. Yay! So, I'm sorry, Poe. Don't kill me. Please. Hey, Cleo's happy. Can I pet you? You sweet ass giraffe. Yeah, good boy. You good boy. Or girl. And remember to close the enclosure. Here we go. We're already a pro at this. Zoo keeping. So I wonder what the horror will be. Will the animals go crazy if we don't... You know... So everything went smoothly? Take Seems care of them. Like I did this for the first time. Hopefully he'll get better soon. Well, don't doubt that. We need to get back to the hub. Alright then. Turn to the hub. So we have wallabies, gorillas, penguins, zebras, moose, hippopotamus, and elephants. Alright then. I'm looking forward to seeing the gorillas, that's for sure. You alright there, Doc? Let's go, Paul. Escort me to the exit. It's time to leave you alone with our lovely zoo facilities. Oh no, please don't leave me alone. That's when the bad things happen, you know? Get the hell out of here, Doc! this oh I'm not sure what I'm doing ah oh, these are the wilds I suppose for the medication where'd you go doc here you are every zookeeper is entitled to a service car this awesome mine. whoa if you perform well tonight you'll get one in the morning hell yeah is that is a that Lambo should I tell her you're staying here for the night keep in mind I'll lock you in until morning no problem I think she'll figure it out and go home soon. As you wish. <laughs> Good luck, Paul. I don't want you to talk yes, to my stop. wife. Oh, she's just standing out there in the rain. Why, why isn't she waiting in the car? Check the next enclosure. Holy crap, we're on our own now. 
What kind of, kind of food do they need? Check the enclosure. Feed the animals. Collect analysis. Measure the sound. He didn't. Blood and sound. He didn't teach us this. We have need all these things for work. I wonder what will happen if I apply them. Not just on animals. If you deviate too much, much from the recipe, the animals might get sick. The risk isn't very high, but it's best not to break the recipe. Seems I'll have to manually record the symptoms of psychosis, scars, and mucus. You didn't teach me all this. Check the enclosure. Which enclosure? Okay, we're on our own. here who knows how long ago you're not answering calls i'm worried i'm gonna stay here all night working lily lily sweetheart sorry didn't hear you right away everything's okay they put me on probation but i had to start immediately you should just go home i'll be back in the morning and tell you everything paul but i saw them lock you up it's not normal yeah it's just protocol here they took away my phone and made me sign an nda and all I have to do is feed and treat the animals. Oh, uh, and by the way, uh, there's plenty of meat here. I want my girls to finally eat normal food. I'll be right back. Don't go away. There's plenty of meat here. That's for the animals, right? Put a meat brick for... Isn't the meat for the animals? <laughs> Put a meat brick for Lily in the parcel drop box. Is this safe for humans to eat? Uh, where was it now? Oh, not here. Where's the cold room? Is it here? No. What's in here, right? How do we open this? What the hell does this thing do? Okay, let's put the trolley... Uh, oh, we have two from the outside, okay. Maybe when we put the trolley over there, it will open the door? find out hey now we can sprint awesome yep meat pick it up let's bring some meat to Lily is this safe for humans to eat <laughs> what the hell Take a brick of meat. Lily, are you here? Yeah. Take this. Give Gina a kiss from Daddy. It's time for me to work. I did that. Okay. So what? What kind of food do we give to? The different animals. Uh, this doesn't tell me. Things. <laughs> Giraffe station, storage room. What is this? Access? Okay. What? Do we just take all kinds? Can we just take all kinds of food here? Take some more herbs. Take some fish. No? Ah, here we go.
You know, recipes from the cauldron. There's a poster with a list of recipes for animals in the cauldron. Ah, okay. Can we then put this thing back? We can. Okay. Then we can decide which enclosure we go to next. And take food accordingly. Penguins eat fish. I want to see the gorillas, you know. One herbal, two and a half vegetable. Okay. Let me take two and a half. Does that mean two and a half brick or two and a half kilo? Is this good? Vegetable and one herbal. Let's try it. See what happens. Is it safe to just, you know, go into the gorilla enclosure? They don't know us. They haven't seen us before, right? Right it. Do we have all the kind of medicine that we need? Hopefully, we'll find out. If not, we can go back, I guess. The gorilla enclosure. Train goes to the current station. Okay. Here we are. Let's put the trolley down. No, oh, we have to. Cut the food for them first, yeah? Uh, did we have to put it down first? I don't remember. <laughs> oh, this was... Where's the food trolley? I don't remember a thing that he told us. <laughs> God damn it. That's the gadget trolley. Where's the food trolley then? Ah, uh, I think we just do it from here, eh? Food bucket is not connected. I'm sorry. Let's put it back up then. We do that from here, eh? There we go. So herbal. Cook. You can vomit if you deviate from the recipe by 20%. Need to cut off one kilo. And this is 2.6. So I need a little less than half of it. Is this good? Wow, I'm good. And vegetable, 2.5 kilos. Oh. Is it right about here maybe? 2.4, that's good. Division is acceptable. Good stuff. Food is ready. We got the food. Now let's bring this down again. Where's the lever? Lever. I don't see it. It's too freaking dark. I saw it before. Do we, can I do it from here? Yep. There we go. Let's go see the gorillas. Phone ringing somewhere. Hello? 
Can I get past here? No. Let's bring this to his place. Oh. But I can't get past, so we have to move this first. Is the phone in here? Hello? What am I holding? But Where the hell's the phone? Can we take it from here? No? Uh, leave. Yeah, now we're moving away. It is in here. It's, it's the loudest in here, right? Hello? What's this? Hydro complex. I can hear it from everywhere, you know? I have no clue where the phone's ringing from. <laughs> this is it? No? Blood collector, okay. I can donate blood. Where the hell's the phone, dude? Uh, no clue. Is it in the storage room? No? Here it is. Hello? Night zookeeper, Paul Connolly. Oh, thank God, finally. Uh, please don't hang up. I've been trying to reach my husband all day. He's a scientist, Clarence J. Summers. People usually call him CJ. I'm sorry, ma'am. I'm here alone. Please check for me. He should be in the lab. Uh, is there a lab here? Oh, I understand. You're new. Mm -hmm. Then one last request. Look in his locker in the break room. Code 1768. Ma'am. This I can't just look right. into people's Paul, I'm begging closets. you. CJ needs to take his medication regularly. I just want to make sure he has them with him. Just open the locker. That's all. I'll call back. I can't just open people's lockers. Right? Where is his locker? Here? Do I have a flashlight or something? No? I don't see anything in this locker. Is there another locker in here? Anthony, I just saw something horrible. I shot lethal dart. But one wasn't enough. It took around 300 milliliters, but it worked. Fuck, it worked. I'm alive. I'm not sure if I should help this woman. I'm not so sure either. Is this? Red X complex. I'm just taking stuff. <laughs> More here. So as I can see, there's nothing in the locker. You know? Let's just go feed the gorillas, right? That's what we're here for. Okay. 
We have Dexter, Pepper, Thor, and Chief. Open and close here. Hopefully, they won't kill us. Hey guys. Are you guys friendly? Can I pet you? They seem friendly enough. Yeah, good boy. Pepper. Let's... Bucket. Let's find their food. Singy, singy. Here it is. Let's dump the food. I wonder when the horror elements come in. You know? Now let's go suck some shit. But there's the shit sucker. It's the TIS. Dart gun. What's this? UV flashlight. He didn't tell us all about uh, these gadgets that we have. Is this shit? No, that's rocks. <laughs> Take the shit. Why didn't it teach us about all the gadgets that we have? No? Do we have more shit lying around? Or do we just follow them? They will shit now after they've eaten is that it yeah i see some shit down here and i guess they all took a shit here we go now let's do their temperatures hello put it that was the mfe right Or the tis? It was the tis, yeah. You guys still up here? There you are. I have Chief and Dexter. Can I get both of them? They look good. Where are the other two? Hello? Oh, they live in here, maybe? Okay. Thor and Pepper? Are they both too hot? No. I think they're good, right? Temperature thingies are green, so I think they're good. Right? Or I'm colorblind, I think it's green. I think they're all good. Uh, put. So do we do the... What does the UV flashlight do? I don't, I, I don't know. What the hell is this thing? Is that good? I think so. I think we were supposed to finish up. Uh, the giraffes, you know, doing this stuff. Where's the last one? Oh, damn it. Okay, we got both of these two. Here we are. Alright, did that. That's done. What else did we have? 
try and bring the UV flashlight. Does that do anything? No? How do we check the water thingy thingy? Switch mode? Does that do anything? No? Okay. So do we just go back and check if this shit is, is good? Close this. The enclosure. I don't know how we check this water thingy. Or is that blood? I don't know. What do we have here? Blood syringe. Okay. Maybe we use that one. Let's try. I suppose we take a blood sample from each one of them. No? What are we doing? Are we doing it? Yep. Okay. Which one of that was it? Hello? Did we... Was it Dexter we did? Okay. Pepper? Here you go. Let's check your blood. See if they're all good. Four? You haven't been checked. Come on, dude. Stand still. Stand still, please. Was that then all of them? Did we do four? I think so, right? I'm not sure. <laughs> I didn't pay attention. We find out when we analyze it, I suppose. Let's put this back. Oh. Interact, please. So Linda never called back. I think her name was Linda, right? Now let's find this shit sucker. Ah, oh, what's this one, right? Put it in here. See if this shit's all good. Or if they have worms. Heal the animals. Uh, heal the animals. Did we check the shit? I don't remember. Uh, go here. Where do we find their blood samples? Blood collector. Here we go. Donate blood. Oh, we are. Uh, I have no clue what I'm doing. How do we see if they are? All right. I don't remember. 
Veterinary station. Diagnosis. Yeah, they were all good, right? Is there something wrong with Dexter's shit? Uh, it's only the shit. We got rotavirus. But are we sure we, we got... All of them? Yeah, it must be, right? Okay, so... Dexter got rotavirus. Rotavirus are a group of viruses that causes gastroenteritis symptoms include diarrhea, vomiting and abdominal pain. Craft rotavirus. Must be rotacara. Right? We have no chemical, okay. Did it say rotavirus? Ah, oh, okay, this is how we... It doesn't really say, right? What kind of medicine we need? Some of them have blood problems, that's BSI, I suppose. And that's the only thing. Hmm. Rotavirus, it must be... Rotacare. But we need chemical. God damn it! Where do... F I think we need to find that... Back at... Uh, at the hub, right? I think the good doctor just left us... You know... Without telling us everything. <laughs> Let's head back. Take all chemicals and stuff that we can find. So we can take care of our good gorillas. I have a feeling we are not getting to any of the horror stuff this episode. This will be a multiple episode game, it seems. Just take... Can we find more drugs lying around? Or this medication thingy stuffy? We did some find some in the storage room as well, so I guess they're just lying around? Sometimes? I don't know. Got some in here? No? I guess we got everything we need. Let's try and make rotavirus. Or rota cure. Rota care. Okay, create. And the other th thing. This one's red and this is another color. What the hell does that mean? I think they're both sick, right? Tor and Chief. With BSI. BSI is a condition where bacteria or other pathogens enter the bloodstream causing serious illness. So what do we need for that? Back to guard. 
bacterial infections. It was a bacterial infections, right? I suppose. Yes. Hopefully. We find out today. Let's go back to the gorillas then. Take the dark gun. How did we uh, load it? Oh shit, how did we load it again? Q? No? Did it from the PDA, right? Submit blood for analysis, haven't we? Because we did the temperature and we did the sound. We did submit feces and blood. Uh, what the hell is this? Pestis relief. Powerful antibacterial. Why did we get that? That we didn't do. Back oh here we have back to guard. We didn't do pestis relief. We did rota care, right? Damn it. That's not what we need. Hopefully we didn't haven't fucked up. New message. Sent your parcel with vials. Awesome. Of the active substance. I think you'll find them useful. You'll find them in the parcel box. Alrighty then. So back to guard. Which one of them needed the back to guard? And why the what? Uh, let's make sure we do the right animal. Now they are sick as well. What? Is it because we are not curing them fast enough? Okay, so... Rotavirus. I'm going to kill these animals, <laughs> I'm pretty sure. Oh shit. So rotavirus. Our PSI was the bacteria thingy. And that is Thor and Chief need the back to guard. Thor and Chief. Oh, it's not the correct way. Open. Yeah, Thor and Chief. Oh, okay, now Dexter's the only one. So we need one more back to guard, right? 
Thor and Chief. Hello, Thor. Come here. Want to shoot in your ass? Because that's the correct place to shoot. This stuff. Is he cured? Who needed Rota care? Can we see that from here? No? Collect analysis. I have no clue what I'm doing, guys. Ah, <laughs> oh, it's Dexter, yeah. Okay, then we need one more back to guard. I have no clue if we are doing this correctly. That didn't sound good. Hopefully we have the ingredients to do more back to guard. was this thing eh? crafting back to guard oh no we need camel god damn it oh, we need to go back again to the hub so i think he meant that he the doctor meant that he put some medication in the drop parcel box thingy find out uh, where was it now through here it is oh we got loads of drugs there man awesome Now we should be able to make back the guard. Right? See if they are cured. Doesn't look like they are cured. Hopefully they we doing this completely wrong. I don't know. Probably. And who did you get? Was it Chief? Uh, back to guard. Use. According to Oh, and they're all Dark Mist that we haven't checked. So we don't know about Chief. Uh oh. Didn't we take a blood sample from Chief? Donate blood. That must check all of them, right? Maybe we didn't even get a sample from Chief. Oops. Why isn't this fixed? I don't know. Can we take the blood syringe? I think that might be it. We didn't 
Get blood from chief. Is that it? Huh? You alright guys? Where the hell are you? Did we fix you, Dexter? It, it doesn't look fixed, you know? Chief! In here? There's four. Yeah, here's Chief. There we go. Let's go back, check him. Can we just jump down here without dying? close this because <laughs> I run that way every time task is complete damn it I didn't check it properly first properly the first time chief is good so we have Tor and Dexter and I think Should be good, right? They're all good. I suppose. Didn't we... Give Thor the back the guard? Let's go shoot him again just to be sure. It was Thor, right? And just do one more rota virus because now of course we have to do a new analysis to see if they are cured, right? Collect analysis. Haven't we submitted all the feces? So instead of bringing this thingy, let's bring the. Oh, we can't. We need to. I guess we didn't get everyone's shit. Can I take it now? Why not? Why can't we pick that up? Do I have to put this down first? Okay. Now Peppers and Dexter is... I'm so disorganized. I have no clue what I'm doing. So Thor, you need back the care. Chief looks cured, right? So they're all green. Yay. Oh, Thor is sick. Right? Because we didn't check their shit or something. Okay. I think we have a, some smelly shit here. Black feces. Right. 
guided there. I guess that was what we were missing there. I suppose. this again then that's complete awesome heal the animals so not all of them are healed Thor what the hell? Oh, they're pathogens. But it does, doesn't say what kind of medicine he needs. Right? No clue. Treatment of ulcerative colitis. Treatment of sepsis. Bacterial infections. Rotavirus infections. I have no clue. <laughs> their shit is good there's only Thor that needs this why doesn't it tell us exactly what kind of medicine we need This is a bacterial infection, right? This other infection by bacteria. God damn it. Blood disease. Aha! Let's try and give him B guard. <laughs> uh oh. Because it was from his blood, yeah? Can we take. Can, we, can I take it? Thank you. B guard. Okay, Thor. Hopefully, we got the right medicine for now. I want to finish this before we... Now Pepper is bad again. What the hell? Thor! Chief. From here, pepper looks good, you know? They're all green. Where the hell's Thor? Alright, boy! Up behind here. There you are! Yeah, we did it! Yes! We finally cured them. Awesome. So on to the next enclosure. Well, we will do that in the next episode. You cured all the animals. Yeah. Of course I did. You know. We will do that. 
go to the other enclosures in the next episode. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please consider leaving a like and subscribe to the channel. And hopefully, you'll get some horror elements going on in the next episode. So thank you all for watching. And until next time, bye bye.